Black-footed ferrets are native to North America and are considered to be the most endangered mammals in the continent. Their name comes from their black legs and feet, although they also have black markings in their faces and tails. They are 45 to 61 centimeters long and 16 centimeters tall. They weigh around 1.5 to 2.5 pounds, making them quite light. Male ferrets, however, are at least 10% larger than females in terms of size. 90% of the diet of black-footed ferrets consists of prairie dogs. A single black-footed ferret can eat up to 100 prairie dogs in a year. This means that they eat one prairie dog every 3-4 to four days. These ferrets eat 7-10% to 10 of their body weight in meat per day. Black-footed ferrets like to live in burrows that were dug out by prairie dogs. While they use these burrows as homes and shelters, they also use them as roads. While they had lived in a large area from southern Alberta and Saskatchewan all the way down to northern Mexico before, they are only found in seven American states and one Mexican state today. Currently, there are only 750 of these ferrets in the wild, and 250 more are raised in captivity. A female ferret will give birth to three to four kits on average, and they will become independent in four months. Black-footed ferrets reach sexual maturity at the age of one. In the wild, Black-footed ferrets are hunted by large birds, foxes, coyotes, and badgers. They are also vulnerable to diseases just like any other animal. However, the one thing that greatly influences the population of black-footed ferrets is the condition of the prairie dogs. Since black-footed ferrets depend on prairie dogs for food and shelter, their population fluctuates depending on their status. In 1981, due to the American effort to get rid of all the prairie dogs, the population of black-footed ferrets decreased to 18. Due to this incident, the remaining 18 ferrets were captured and put into a captive breeding program. A recovery plan was formulated in the United States to go with this captive breeding of the ferrets. The plan states that the ferrets should be put into reintroduction sites in different population groups. There will be 30 adult ferrets that are capable of breeding per group, which will hopefully increase the overpopulation of the black-footed ferret.